Hi everyone, I'm Julie Gee, the naturalist at Burr Oak State Park. Today we're going to take a look at three of our showiest spring wildflowers, plus one unique wildflower. While you're enjoying the video, be thinking about why trilliums are called trilliums. Let's go take a look. Virginia bluebell is one of our most popular spring wildflowers. Of course, it's so showy with pink buds to start out, which then blossom into these blue tubular flowers. A rare white form of Virginia bluebell can sometimes be found. Virginia bluebell can form extensive colonies, which are just spectacular. Blue-eyed Mary is so distinct and recognizable because of its bi-colored flowers. White petals above and blue below. Sometimes you can find a Blue-eyed Mary that has pinkish purpley lower petals instead of the characteristic blue of Blue-eyed Mary. Blue-Eyed Mary is an annual, which means that it relies on its seed stock to recolonize an area the next year. Blue-Eyed Mary epitomizes the term carpet of wildflowers. Large flowered trillium is one of the showiest, most common trilliums in Eastern North America. The scientific name says it all, Trillium grandiflorum. This is indeed a grand wildflower. After germination, a trillium first produces only one leaf. It requires another six to seven years before it flowers for the first time. All trilliums come in parts of three. Three sepals, which are leaf-like structures that are holding the flower, three petals, and three leaves. Large flowered trillium is the state wildflower of Ohio and you can see why. There's just nothing like a hillside full of large flowered trillium. Cecil trillium is very different for a trillium. The strange upright flower has maroon petals and no stalk. This plant also has spotted or mottled green leaves. Another common name for Cecil Trillium is toad shade. You can probably guess why this plant has been called toad shade. I hope you enjoyed taking a look at those showy wildflowers. Trilliums are called trilliums because their parts come in threes. Three leaves, three flower petals, and three sepals. The sepals are the part of the flower that holds the petals in place, and they're usually green. Thanks for joining me today, folks. Until next time, stay safe, be well, and get outside.